We teach the science and art of ecstasy. We teach people how to turn on or how to go out of their minds. By turn on, we mean um, to tune in, to get beyond your routine uh, ways of thinking and acting and experiencing. In 1961, two of Harvard University's best and brightest minds discovered psilocybin and LSD. Richard Alpert, who later changed his name to Ram Das, and Timothy Leary, along with graduate student Ralph Metzner, began doing psychedelic research on a wide scale, conducting projects with religious leaders and prison communities, among others. Harvard's administration eventually grew uncomfortable with the amount of media attention Leary was receiving and canceled the project. Leary, Alpert, and Metzner moved first to Mexico and then to upstate New York to continue working with these substances. We were like middle-class academics. And uh, our, our role, I think, in retrospect, was to try to find some way that I, the professional middle-class world of psychologists, psychotherapists, and so forth could uh, accommodate these experiences. <laughs> 